see you all here. Welcome everybody to Dinkum, our first stream of the day and at a whole different time. Thanks everybody for being here. My internet provider was upgrading the whole neighborhoods or the whole town's internet today. So there was a heck of a lot of construction going on. And so my internet was uh, down for about two hours, you know, randomly on and off throughout the whole day. So, you know, because streaming requires an online internet connection all the time and since uh, I couldn't really do much else, I went to an amusement park and hung out with some uh, family and mutual friends today when I was driving to my cousin's house to meet up with him uh, before we met a few other people that we know at the amusement park. I saw all the construction vehicles like rolling into town, so it looks like they were doing some hefty work and I, I kept my computer online to see when things were up and down and yep, looks like I made a good move. So anyway, welcome to Dinkum. Uh, you guys can see some awesome photos and stuff on my Instagram, too. Links down below in the description. I think I got a little sunburn, too. Ooh, looks way worse than it actually is. Holy... Did it really look that bad? Oh, yeah. Wow. Maybe it's the shirt. I went and looked at myself in the mirror. A little burn. low color. But, uh, oh, well. We'll be fine. That looks way worse than it is. Yeah. Exclamation point Instagram. Exclamation point Twitter. I'll be posting some photos over the next couple of days. So anyway, thanks everybody for joining me in a stream I wasn't sure I was going to do. I'm uh, kind of tired. Did a lot of walking today. Also went out to eat at a really cool restaurant that my uh, I went to before with my cousin, but I hadn't gone to since 2019 because of the whole pandemic. And um, yeah, now it's back open again, and it's it was great to go there. So anyway, Dinkum, this game is awesome. For those of you who love games like uh, Stardew Valley or maybe Terraria, but more like Stardew Valley and maybe uh, Animal Crossing, this game is really, really cool. Taking place in the Australian Outback, uh, you get to build yourself. Now, apparently it's hinted at possibly being in a, some sort of a post-apocalyptic future where everything's got some weird names to it, but you know how it is with those Australians. They like to name all sorts of things weird names. Like, they call a fl an extendo flute, they call a didgeridoo. Do not listen to the Australians. Uh, I've seen this game blowing up, too. We, we played this game when it released. I put out a video a while ago. And a lot of people thought it was pretty cool, but uh, I went on Twitter, and all the people that I watch uh, were playing it, and some big people on Twitch, too. So I guess everybody's kind of in the mood for a wonderful little uh, survival base builder with combat. This game has combat. This game has base building, farming, exploration, a lot of skills and stuff that you can uh, unlock and grind out. So it's a hell of a lot of fun. So good to see you all here. Welcome aboard. Uh, yeah, I had ramen, by the way, chat. And I'm going to put up some delicious photos of ramen. Holy crap. And I had a nice little um, thingy, I don't know what you call it, like a rock tumbler or whatever of sake. Going, uh, We played uh, a game called Bartender Hustle recently, and it kind of made me want like an adult beverage. And, and I went and had one, and my God, sake was uh, so good, earthy, and just went so well with that ramen. So I'm, I'm so, I'm on cloud... Well, like, cl Cloud 9's a good thing, but, like, is Cloud 10 better? Or would Cloud 7 be better? I don't know. Whatever. I'm, a, I'm on Cloud Final Fantasy 7. That's what I'm on. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's that's one for the boys. Here, I need something to perk up. Well, we'll be uh, returning to our regularly scheduled streams tomorrow. Uh, looks like the internet provider is uh, basically good for what they needed to do today. They'll still be doing construction, but... Uh, the outage is over, so hopefully I get better internet. So tomorrow we're going to play Stray. Tomorrow and the PM around the same time, uh, Bradford will be around, so we're going to do another later PM stream of um, Hell Let Loose. And also Stray, I don't think, comes out till noon, so we'll probably do like a... Uh, my usual times will both be delayed by about two hours, so just based on the, the release times and people's availability. So Circle 7 salutes. And by the way, chat, I have a surprise for you. Early in the morning... Before I went out to the amusement park, I got something that I think you guys are going to love. Well, aside from Christy being a member for four months. Thank you very much, Christy, for your support. Guys, after all this time... No, I don't want to say it. No, I should. All right, I'll tell you the secret if chat gets to 150 likes. And I'll, I'll tell you the secret of what I've been working on. Oh, this game also has multiplayer. This would be great. Booster's also been playing the hell out of this game. So if you watch my friend Booster, uh, make sure you go ahead and uh, check out his channel, exclamation point Booster in the chat. Let's do view distance at five. Oh, this game also has um, controller support. Awesome. 
All right, uh, let's go ahead and start a new game, and we'll uh, start fresh. Aaron? No. Uh, I'd like to be me. Is there not a sunburn tone? I need that now. Ah, uh, it looks worse than it is. I'm telling you. Looks worse than it is. You know what I think it is? I put on some lotion uh, before and after, and that stuff irritates my skin too. So it's like a lose-lose for me. Oh, cool. Different hair colors. All right, we're going with... Um, Bob Ross, is that you? Oh boy. All right, so now I got to tell everybody the secret. Everybody got 150 likes. The secret is there are new sound effects in the store. All new sound effects. All the old stuff's gone. There's a bunch of new stuff. Not all the old stuff, but there's a, a ton of new stuff. And there'll be more soon. I haven't finished uploading them all. So there's probably going to be about 14 new sound drops for you all to enjoy. So hurry, hurry. Uh, all right, let's go with... I guess this? I'll go with this. Uh, the eyes are weird. I think we'll go with the first one. Green eyes are fine. I think that nose is fine. That's fine. Love this short sleeve shirt like that. That's cute. I like that. All right, let's go with this. Apparently we don't have shoes. Is that a thing? Australia, do you not wear shoes? What's your friend, uh, what's your name? Uh, my name is Raptor. And what is the island's name? New Pepsi. No, no, it's a uh, new Raptoria. Yeah, that's right. Okay, cool. And let's go. A long time ago, everything went south. Almost everybody was forced to move to South City. The people of South City live cold and miserable lives. You were born here. Molded by it. Uh, most people have no desire to leave. But you do, more than anything. And you might have found a way out. Boy, is everybody, like, dressed in prisoner outfits? It's, like, gray. Help wanted. Looking for a young go-getter to accompany me to my old... Oh, it didn't even, like, give me a time. Okay. It's an on-rails cutscene. You leave for New Raptoria today. Oh, there's a dirigible. Wait, did I find a way out like how Charlie found that golden ticket in Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? Damn fine movie. I don't care for the remake. I like the original with, uh, uh, what's his name? Gene, Gene Wilder? Yeah, Gene Wilder, the OG. Him. We are now flying over New Raptoria and will be landing shortly. All passengers prepare to leave the airship. Oh, this is Fletch. Uh, looks like we've landed. Why does it say zero one sun zero one sum? Sun and sum. I'll tell you what. I'm so glad you've decided Reminder, to accompany. This is a bear free environment. Yeah, uh, yeah. Chat would would start with that one. Jesus, even I forgot about that one. Scared me. Yes. Reminder, chat. This is a bear free environment. Oh, sum means summer. Thank you. Uh, I'm so glad you've decided to accompany on me on this adventure, Raptor. I was starting to think no one in South City was brave enough to join me. You can join me by clicking or tapping join, of course. 
with the link down below in the description or make sure you have the allow button turned on to allow so that way anybody in the chat can drop a gift bomb and gift you a membership when you were first and only person to respond respond to my ad i knew you were the right person for the job well not like she had a choice if we were the only one oh dear look at old fletch waffle on let's get cracking i'll see you outside okay okay wow wow smell that fresh air tell you what it feels good to finally be back in new raptoria now raptor i'm gonna need your help getting settled okay uh, i'll give you this base tent take your time and find a good place for it it'll be like our town hub take this map as well if you have any questions please ask me i haven't been back to new raptoria for a very long time but i think it could i could still be helpful i'll be waiting by the dock until you set up your base tent if you get lost just check your map to find the dock again good luck yeah well the music is badass you need to read those with an Auss aussie accent god uh island map pins can be placed on it to mark points of interest okay so here's where our island is boys wow lots of wetlands that's gonna be teeming with crocs um plains it's like nice grasslands up here. Let's go explore up there. Okay, bye, ma'am. Right, so we can look around. Where's the Outback Steakhouse? Uh, we're gonna make a strip mall for that one. Oh, I know this will be useful. Let's grab the gum logs. Minty fresh. All right, a base of operations. Place the base tent and talk to Fletch. Oh, we gotta go all the way back to her after this. Oh, wait, are these just sands? No, there's something else here. And clams. Yeah, we can sell these for a little bit of money. Here comes the money. Animal Crossing? Kind of. It certainly looks like that, but... Animal Crossing Australia meets uh, look, maybe a little Minecraft in here, too. I guess if you look at it a certain way. Maybe. So this is the oh it's a jungle oh that's a this this is bananas hey okay, wait okay i don't like how we have to right click again to pick up na the nanners but i guess i'll settle all right so this is jungle this is like dry land little lake there island oh do i hear a waterfall or is that just the lake river bro if there's a waterfall i want it Oh. Sounds like there could be one. Yeah, this is open world. Build a base wherever you want. Mine wherever you want. Cut down trees. Do whatever you want. There's also like an underground um, area to like fight in. There's like caves and stuff to go down into. Mines. We'll find out as we go. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. This must be the Discord at like noon. Dead. All right, let's make a base probably. Actually right here is a pretty good spot to like maybe build some buildings. We could build a bridge later maybe on. Pretty narrow areas to make bridges. Okay, ah, I think we found our home. Oh boy, that is a doggo. Are you a good boy or are you okay? He doesn't care. All right, uh, let's go ahead and build. Maybe down on this peninsula. Uh, can we mine fossils? I think so. Oh, we have to pick them up somehow. Uh, my inventory is full though. All right, let's place our tent. Uh, I think we can move these tents too after we get started, so it's not too big of a deal. I think where we settle. But I'm going to build up here. Clear out this land a little bit. And we're going to plop it down right here. I don't think I can be in the way. 
How do I rotate? No. Glad you had fun today, Raptor, N and nice tan. Tan's always here. What do you mean? Is this a good spot for the base tent? Yes. So, this is where you decided to build, huh? Uh oh, she's judging. It's absolutely perfect. Oh, good. Our new home here in New Raptoria. Thank you so much for setting up the base tent. And guess what? I actually have a tent for you, too. I know it's not much, but it'll be a place you can call home. Now, there's plenty of room to spread out here on New Raptoria, so please take your time to place your tent. You'll probably be visiting the base tent a fair bit. So keep that in mind while you're looking for a spot to claim as your own. I'll be inside the base tent getting things ready. Come and speak to me when you place your tent. Oh, it looks like the same as the last tent. Okay. Silver Freaks, thank you very much for becoming a Raptor Egg again. Welcome back. Look at the doggos. I, I need to be able to be friends with them. You know, Tan, I'm glad you're actually putting Tupperware in the chat. I had to... There was so much food that I got at the uh, beautiful, like, um... Laotian slash, like, Thai slash Welcome. Japanese place that I went to. I, I had I had to tap out. It was a moment of shame. But a moment of pride. That there was so much good food that it was like, man, I've never felt feelings like that before. I will build over here. This is the hoose, boys. Ah, uh, yeah, there were turkey legs. I didn't want to eat too much stuff at the amusement park. Uh, I had a pronto pup, which is basically like a corn dog, but it is a uh, uh, in like a wheat dough batter kind of thing. Now let's see. I want to build here, but I want there to be like a nice backyard for me too. Hopefully I can move this later. Which rides did I go to? I went to all the roller coasters that I could. One of them was closed for maintenance, my favorite. Known as Steel Venom, which is kind of one of those that like launches you forward with magnets and then launches you backwards and stuff. Um, but I went on uh, like corkscrew roller coasters and super high ones and a couple of wood roller coasters and hybrids. It's the uh, childhood amusement park for me. So it's a... Uh, a near and dear spot to my heart. Oh, here's our home. Cool. All right, well, this is our new house now. Next to the research tent. Roadhouse, thank you very much for the 19 months as a raptor egg. Ah, you found a good place for your tent? Ah, I know it's not much, but I hope you like your new home. Tell you what, you got spark, raptor. See, most people, hey man, back in South City, they've changed, man. They're like Bradford when you ask him to join a stream, okay? Yeah, man, he's probably listening right now. He knows what he did. And they're scared of leaving. Is there... Uh, there's something out about... There's something about that place that pulls the spark out of people. But I'll tell you what. We certainly aren't the first to leave. Have you ever heard of the traveling Trader John? Of course not. Is he anything like Trader Joe's? I'll tell you what, he's a bloody legend. Whoa, ma'am, whoa, it's a PG stream. Whoa, ma'am, you're going to get me pulled over by the YouTube police. Uh, rumor is that his parents acquired him. Wait, what? Rumor is that his parents acquired him by trading a set of antique cutlery. Trading is in, in his very blood. John got in contact with me before we left South City. He's interested in visiting with his shop here. I'll tell you what, we can't miss an opportunity like this. I reckon we need to get the visiting site deed ready for him. That way he'll come, uh, that way he'll have a place ready for any visitors who come to New Raptoria. I'll let you decide where the best place for the visit, visit visiting site deed is. Just be sure it's close by. We want visitors to feel like part of New Raptoria community while they're here. Who knows, maybe we can convince him to set up a permanent shop. Be sure to talk to me once you place the visiting site deed. So it's like a little uh, area for him to build a house or set up. What's up, Joe? You like Trader Joe's? Well, of course, I would imagine. With you share sharing the same name. 
It's like if your name was TGI Fridays and you enjoyed going to TGI Fridays. And you'd be like, man, my friend TGI Fridays is so biased. Every time we talk about going to TGI Fridays, he's like, that's my place, tee -hee. Like, TGI Fridays, you need to stop. Okay, we want to go to Applebee's. You can't go to Applebee's! Anyway, I'm dating Chili's now. She's my girlfriend and I love her. Alright, where are we going to put a town shop? Now somebody's going to come to our town and start shop... Um, like opening up shop for us. Or with us. Or whatever. Uh, maybe we could put it down... Well, let's put it up here. Oh, let's put him by the beach. Oh god, bugs. Oh, I hate him. hate bugs. I don't know if I've gone fishing in this game yet. Every game has to have a fishing minigame, though. It's like, required by law. It'll be like his beach bungalow. Let's put it over here. Um... I'll put the entrance here so I can actually see it. There we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, fish out of water. Or is that normal for Australia? Oh, oh boy. Oh, he's coming. The land shark. Sir? Okay. Let's, oh god, okay, I was gonna help you back in the water. Okay. Well, it's on now, pal. No, come over here. Come over here. What the hell? Oh my god. Oh my god, that... What the hell? Whoa! Whoa! What the? Did you guys just see that? Bro. He just drowned him. What is going on? Australia is absolutely brutal. Holy crap. Bro. That kangaroo is just like taking a sip of water and this guy comes up out of nowhere. Meanwhile, there's land sharks. The hell out? Quit in this game. Okay. Wow, this is violent. Holy crap. Any Australians in chat? No, there couldn't be. They'd all be dead. Impossible. Wow, and look at this. That was his accomplice. They're laughing about it. Oh, no honor among thieves. Oh, they're battling it out. Oh, and he lost. I do not want to go in that water again. That's for damn sure. Well, let's go in the water again. Bone, 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 bone. Yeah, we're picking up all sorts of bones now. That's good. Stay the hell back, shark. I got a gun. Okay, we are not... We're not going across that river again without going far away from that shark. Holy crap, he nearly killed us to death. Wow. Australia is violent as hell. And we've been only here like half a day. Okay, uh, where's ma'am? Oh, talk to Fletch now. Okay, we can talk to her again. She's at the other place. There has to be drop bears in this game? Something. Kangaroo with a gun? Something. So, we're all set for visitors, huh? I don't know if John's gonna want to visit after that, dude. Been murders already. Can't believe it. Well done, Raptor. We've only been here for a little while, but you've achieved so much already. You remind me of my father. He was born right here in New Raptoria, you know. Really? Sorry he died at literally the age of one. Second. Uh, he was a true blue adventurer through and through. He loved doing it, new things and keeping track of all his milestones in his adventurer's journal. Uh, I wanted to come here and try to meet those milestones myself. But I'm getting a bit long in the tooth, Raptor. Please, 
I want you to take this adventurer's journal. Please keep good care of it. This is your adventure now. Yes, I'm the adventurer now. Clutch's father's journal. It's filled with past milestones. Yeah! That journal means a lot to me. But I think my dad would uh, be glad someone like you is looking after it. I have a challenge for you. I want you to try and beat my father's milestones. Some of these milestones are going to take a long time to complete, but there's no hurry. I'm also going to add daily tasks to the journal. These will be smaller milestones that should be easy to complete in just one day. Now, for the good part. For every milestone you surpass, you'll be rewarded with permit points. I'll tell you what, you're going to want a lot of permit points eventually, but we can talk about more about that tomorrow. For now, check the journal. I think you'll find that you've actually completed some of the milestones inside. So be sure to claim them. Now, are you hungry? I am. I think it's about lunchtime. I see fruit on uh, growing around the island. That sounds tasty. Go and find us some fruit, and when you get back, I'll show you how to craft a campfire. Well, I already found fruit. Oh, you found something to eat. Eating food will help keep your energy up. Here's a recipe for the campfire. Found these stones earlier, so you can use these to craft your campfire. You'll have to find some wood yourself, though. Feel free to use the crafting table in the base tent to craft a campfire. Take your time. When you're done, come have a chat with me. I have a gift for you. Stone. Rock solid. Campfire. A fire you can use while camping. Well, imagine that. Uh, well, it's just a book. Here's what we want. So it takes two gum logs and three stone. Yeah, first try. Okay, so let's move that here. And then let's do... Campfire near our house. Uh, how do I make food? God, yep, that, yep, it had to happen sometime. There it goes. Honestly, I lasted about a second longer than I thought I would. Okay. We can pick up the fire, but let's do this. Ah, there it is. Ah, yes. Campfire Roasted Bananas. A classic. Patrick, thanks for the 11 months as a little raptor. Are you going to do a multiplayer for this game? Looks cool. Yeah, I'd like to, actually. Uh, we'll have to see a little bit more about multiplayer and see how many players I can host. We could do a big community thing. Um, I think maybe what I'll do is like have a separate server for me and then one for my friends. We'll see how many people are interested in it. So, as always, make sure you smash like if you like the games I play so you uh, can tell me that you want me to show you more we can come back to them time and time again I'm very impressed with the work you've done here today Raptor see somebody likes me I think there's a great future for all of us here at New Raptoria New here's member. a gift for helping Welcome. me out so much it's a bug net I think you should take the rest of the day off maybe you can go and catch some uh, the bugs around here or maybe you could cook some of that fruit you found uh, I'll figure something out I'm sure you will Oh, before I forget, take this sleeping bag, too. When you get tired, pop that on the ground. You'll have to lay down. I'll tell you what, a good night's rest will do us both good. Thanks for your help today. Can't believe we're in New Raptoria. I couldn't have done any of this without you. So encouraging and helpful, my goodness. Australia is the stuff of legends. Now, too long ago, a farmer discovered that he and his family had hoard... What? Had hoarded World War II aircraft to keep... Kept them in the barn since the war ended. Wow. <clears throat> There's our sleeping bag. All right, thank you, Jessica Fletcher. Now it's time to go here and plop down the old bag of sleep. Uh, let's see. And maybe we'll put it over here. Oh god. Okay. All right. Fire's got to move. Wow. Okay, that's that's moving.
Okay, I can't be trusted. But that's gotta go on the side of the house. I got too excited. Okay. Oh, great. Now we gotta hear the uh, Zelda low health uh, one heart sound now. Alright, uh, what's our daily tasks? Uh, let's see. I don't think this game pauses either. Like, when you go into this menu, it's still, like, it doesn't pause. Harvest three bush limes, catch two bugs, and craft an item. How do I use the, uh, bug net thingy? Oh, I see. Oh, let's go find some bugs. And we also got to find a bush lime tree. Hmm. That's a long... Oh man, these are really long distances to cover. That shark's nearby. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's one task done. Nope, that's white flow, God. Rocks. Oh, wait, they're little trees, aren't they? They're more like this. That's what we're looking for. Cool, one task done. Bow, bow. Uh, what was the game that Raptor played about a year ago? It was like a mission-based multiplayer and you got in the elevator thingy to deploy the next mission. Uh, you could be thinking about like Alien Fireteam Elite or something. I remember that's where we had to go to elevators. Deep Rock Galactic maybe? If, if you give me more information I might be able to like kind of decipher it. the name of my chair? Uh, the DX Racer. I think all my equipment lists and stuff are down below. I think the chair is part of that list. Alright, butterflies, we passed two. Okay, let's see. I see one here. First try! <laughs> Damn it. They're tricky. That camera angle. There, that's the first try. Scarlet Jezebel. I know in this game, bugs sell for a hell of a lot, and also so do certain, uh... I love in this game how you can sell a lot of stuff for money. I know, uh, I think it's, um... Shells will sell for a lot. I'd keep them for my all myself, but that would be... Shellfish. Chair's not on the list? Okay. Then it is the DX Racer. I see my phone exploding with people following me and saying hi on Instagram and stuff, so thank you very much. I will uh, respond to as many of you as I can on Instagram after the stream. You guys want to follow me? Uh, big stuff going on today. Big news, big announcement. I finally went outside. Wait, the green screen does not like that yellow, does it? Thinks that it's green. Oh, well. Uh, is there cooperative campaign mode or visit worlds? From what I understand, you can play with other people in, like, this map. But I think if you play with others, everybody's got to be in the same world, which is kind of cool. But also, it would be a a nice to have the option to go somewhere else. I don't know. I've only played a little bit of this game. But there could be the option for other islands and other places to go eventually.
Metal detector will equal money? Good. I'm excited. I like looking on the beaches for shells. Well, that shark must be gone. Dog's been out there swimming for a while. Uh, insects and waterfall update for Planet Crafter? Yeah, we'll check that out as soon as it drops. Last thing I saw from the devs is they basically said soon. Ooh, look at this. Okay, we got some minerals over here. Coal, iron, etc. We might need a lot of wood for if we do smelting, so I'm going to grab everything. I will learn as I go. Okay, well, we know there's lots of metals here. Oh, Croc waiting for us. American Eagle, thanks for the one year as a Raptor Ultimate member. Congratulations on your one year. That is awesome. Thank you very much. A new member, welcome. Wow. Uh, just as an FYI, we've got about uh, 14 new sound effects in the uh, sound store for those of you who watch the channel. Just by being in the chat and just watching the channel, everybody here earns like what's known as dino dollars. Essentially what it is is there's just a bot in the chat that just tracks how long you watch and how active you are in the chat. You'll earn points for being here. Then you can spend those points on funny sound effects and stuff to get chat to totally not spam bears, that's for sure. Uh, I would hate that, so. Oh, is Deep Rock Galactic? Ah, okay, yeah, we played that recently. There's a live stream of that one, yeah. Oh, Birder, Birder Fleur. How many minutes? I keep thinking the butterflies is just kind of like a pretty background thing. I keep forgetting I can harvest them. Oh, come back, butterfly. Oh, that's a big butterfly with feathers. Wow. There's another one. A Ulysses. There's also funny descriptions for all the items in this game. This, ga this game is great. Like, it's kind of more cutesy cutesy and all, but there's definitely combat. There's like spears and. Uh, slingshots and underground combat, like how it is in Stardew and stuff. Cool. Oh, those are not uh, rocks. We gotta name sh the shark. Next person to drop a member bomb in the chat, we will name the shark after you. No pressure or anything. We'll probably be playing this more than once. I actually wanted to play this earlier in the week. Um... But I didn't get it. So, so many games were coming out, I had to play a couple of other ones. There were so many other new games, too. Uh, using the points should be down below in the description. Oh, what is this? That, that doesn't look like it's in good shape at all. All right, Patrick it is. Thank you very much, Patrick. Wow. Gift bomb. Emote. Oh, somebody... Wait, I don't know if that sound effect's in yet. By tomorrow, all the sound effects will be in, though. I'll have them all in tomorrow. I did them all this morning before I had to leave. Thank you very much, dude. Patrick... Patrick Shark. Patrick Sharkfish. That's what we'll call him. How appropriate. What's up, Jessica B? Good to see you. I think you were playing Gas Station Sim this morning. Was that right, Jessica? Did I see you? We gotta get you to play this. It's Canada. It's like a Canada simulator. Except it's all Australia. But like if you were just to take Canada, except it's not, but it's it's uh, Australia, you, you'll be able to play. Okay, well we just did all of our daily tasks. That's pretty awesome. All right, we'll get these flowers, too. Everything we can sell, so we gotta, like, hoard. Especially when, uh... John C. Merchandise comes to the town. Hey, 
And Hard Lady Angel 83 Xbox Live. Thank you very much for becoming a Raptor Egg. Welcome aboard. Green eyes in the chat, boys. And I'm uh, I'm gonna ask Art to make a cat. Uh oh, that shark is Patrick. You stay away, sir. Stay over there. It looks like he didn't notice me. Uh, I'm gonna make uh, a cat emote for me for Stray tomorrow. And uh, maybe we'll get one for Hell Let Loose. Actually, we got a good one for Hell Let Loose. I'll put the commander New member. Welcome. army dino back in the uh, back in the rotation. Okay, so we completed all the daily tasks. So we get these things, which are known as... I forgot, like commission points or something? Let's talk to the lady. Oh, hi. We've done some good work today. Take the rest of the day off. Uh... Okay, I'm gonna... Cook food. Why is he catching butterflies? Why not spiders? Oh god. Should have known spiders were in this game. Oh. Woe is me. At least we don't have to like continuously put wood on the fire. That's nice. But I think in Australia legally you need to know how to put shrimp on the barbie to be like a citizen. I'm just going to cook up some Din Din for a while. You're liking this game? Yeah. Well, it starts out with, um, you know, just tents and, like, literally nothing in the world except for, like, some hidden secret stuff. Uh, but then you can build, like, a whole community and people will move in. Kind of like how it is with the Terraria. Sometimes, too, like, merchant and stuff will move in. Oh, it looks like we unlocked something more. Uh, does watching the channel with premium help help your channel? Yes. If you get YouTube premium and you watch the channel, YouTube will give me a cut of whatever you paid for YouTube premium based on your watch time. So, uh, yeah, no ads for you. And the longer you watch the channel, the more I get paid. But no pressure. You watch as long as you'd like. Subscribe if you'd like to. Become a member if you'd like. Say hi in the chat if you'd like. Whatever you feel like doing. Welcome aboard. Sleeping heals everything? Oh, that's good. I'm going to cook all these up, though, because there's going to be a time where I'm probably going to be attacked by that shark again, and I can't just throw down the uh, the old sleeping bag. You have YouTube Premium, best thing ever? Yeah. It's it's almost like as if the ads have made YouTube, like, unusable. And it's starting to become like how a mobile game is, where it's like, okay, we're going to make... You can play this game for free, but we're going to make the grind so impossibly difficult and unfun that the only way you can enjoy this $60 game that you bought is paying $120 more. Only possible way. Like, we we could remove these artificial barriers that we designed and put into the game and cooked from day one, but no. We're not going to. Okay, 14 yummy yums. We cook these. Hey Stan, ML32 with the 11 months as a little raptor just joined the Steam a, a stream after work. Streams are great. Keep up, keep on keeping on. You got him, my man. Yeah, we've been live less than an hour. Feels good, man. Having a good time. What's up, Devora? How you doing? Welcome. Hello. Yeah, don't be afraid to say hi in the chat now, especially if you're uh, new. We we've got quite a nifty audience here. And uh, people of all different backgrounds and watching from all over the world. And that makes me proud. I'm glad that uh, so many people feel welcomed and we're all united by our true, true loves. Food and gaming. With gaming being far more important. Well, you need food to live. But also you need food to live in gaming. So, yeah. What's up, Salad? How you doing? All right. What is that? Is that a little frog? Where'd he go? Ooh, cactus.
Ooh, you can catch him. A black cricket. Nice. Hey, what's up, Outdoor Gaming? Good to see you. Raptor, I'm getting premium just to support you that little extra. Hey, man, that that's cool and all, but that does that does you a big favor. Imagine just how much time Reminder, it saves you. This is a bear-free environment. God. Well, Australia better be. Oh, they got... Oh, no. They got koalas in Australia. Oh, God. Well, luckily, I think koala bears are slow. And don't they just get high on eucalyptus or something? Is that a bug? It is. A cockroach. Wow. Lucky me. Uh, are there large spiders and things that can kill you? Yeah, we've already seen a shark and crocodiles. There's, uh, I would imagine, dingoes and wallabies. and Yep, there's definitely combat in this game for sure. Yep, this game is multiplayer, yep. Yep, multiplayer has combat. I don't know if you can do PvP in the game, though. Not sure about that one. Oh, there's nanners up there. Oh, where are my manners? Thanks for the nanners. What the hell's that? Oh, a giant bug! Damn, he escaped. I'll bug him later. Oh, and e oh yeah, emus too. Jeez. What's up, Norman B Gaming? Good to see you. You do not progress the story equally in multiplayer. Only the host does. Oh. Well, <clears throat> I think this game has been made by one person too, so I'm sure that there's now that the game is released and that they're getting money from the uh, sales of all the. Uh, you know, from the game coming out. Hopefully they take that money to, you know, listen to gamer feedback. All, all the people buying the game, they're like, I love this game, except I wish these things were different. And then they can work on doing that. That's basically what happened with Stardew Valley. The developer did such a good job of listening to people and trying to make the best game possible. Hey, a firefly. That uh, Stardew Valley, if, if you go back and look at what Stardew Valley was at, like, release and, like, during its alpha, the game has changed a lot. And it's even better now. Several years on. Nice. The Raptor, the guy we raided yesterday was hilarious. Ugh. I... Chat, you bring me up the PTSD because I wish... I want to be able to raid more channels. I think I have to not do that because... YouTube doesn't let me properly do it. Maybe we should keep trying. Anyway, I'm glad you guys enjoyed the people that we raid after the streams. After we're done here, we'll find somebody else who's playing Dinkum, and we'll all go say hi to their channel and just go be nice. Cool. Spreading that good energy, good vibes, good times. All right, let's go uh, to bed. Wait. No, that's the skull. Wait. The doggo sleeping here? Hey, buddy. Bedtime for Dino Man. Let's call it a night. Oh man, we're 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 upgrading. Oh boy. Oh dinks are the name of the currency, yeah. Okay. So forging, wow, we got like 30 logs, 69, nice. 69 flowers, nice. And a bunch of bugs. Game's full of bugs. Tools will break if you use them too much. Someone is visiting the island. We better, better go say hello. Uh, what platforms is this game available? I think it's uh, just PC for now. I think it's a one dev or a very small team, so if they have plans to bring it to council, it'll, it'll probably be a little while. Actually, let's talk to Fletch.
Ah, good morning, Raptor. Did you happen to see John and set up a tent at the visitor site? I told him all about you and how you helped us get started here. He sounded impressed. John trades all sorts of things back to South City. I reckon nearly anything you find on this island will be valuable to him. He'll buy fruit, fish, bugs, and even rocks. Uh, John also sells useful tools. He's got mining equipment, logging tools, and even some fishing equipment. Oh yeah, here's the uh, here's the caveat. You can't probably can't sell you a lot of tools until you have a light your licenses in order. You know about licenses? No. Licenses are an old South City idea. I'll tell you what, you don't need a license for anything back when I was growing up. But these days you need a license for everything. Luckily I'm an accredited license giver. If you want to apply for a license, come and talk to me. I'll need to spend some permit points to get them, but if you keep doing milestones, you'll make enough in no time. As you get better at doing certain tasks, new license levels will open up too. Let's see if there's a license you can apply for right now. Uh, nope. I don't really have a lot of, uh, accreditation, ma'am. Uh, unless... I turn in these. All of our juicy, juicy milestones. Shell, yeah! Cool. So as we collect things, we gain points and whatnot, so that's pretty cool. So, entomo entomologist, camper... Explore hot fruit. Walking around. Bug catching. And harvest master. Cool. Uh, harvest nine yellow wattle flowers. Plant one seed and catch three more bugs. That's our goals for today. Well, now we can talk to Fletch. I just noticed that John is selling a table saw. This is a tool I think will be very handy indeed. I think we should try and make enough money to buy a table saw from John. Here's my half of the dinks, the rest is up to you. Yeah. Whoa, we got 2,500 bucks? Thank you, ma'am, holding out on us. More wood is needed. You gonna go drink some ranch? Wow, seriously. Okay, times are desperate for you. You salad, you. Uh, how goes the money making? Have you earned enough to buy the table saw? Uh, a little bit to go, I guess. Go check the prices here in a minute. I wanted to see if I could buy more. Yeah, give me. Oh yeah, I want to apply for a license. Yeah, there we go. All right, give me the mining. Mining level one. Yeah. Give me the logging license. Anya. Fishing. And excavation costs 500. Hunting is 250. Why are you guys making me crave cheese? I gotta figure out if there's still a place nearby I can get mozzarella sticks. Oh, bro. Mozzarella sticks are badass, man. Uh, we're gonna save points for the excavation. I think I'm gonna start doing all the, like, gathering of local resources before we start building. If we're gonna do building, it's probably a good idea that we unlock all the stuff to actually build with, like, the table saw and logging, uh, cutting down trees. Alright, let's go buy an axe and a table saw from John. Hi, Binging with Babish. How are you? Amish Babish. John. Ah, oh, you must be Raptor. Fletch told me you're the one to thank for getting this place all set up for me. Thanks for that. I have a feeling we'll be doing a lot of business together. Take a look at my wares and feel free to ask about anything you're interested in. I make most of my dinks on selling exotic items back to South City. I guess you could say exotic means any of the items found here in New Raptoria. Oh, John, you're so funny, dude. This guy. <laughs> so if you find anything, and I do mean anything you don't want, please drop by and show me. I'll offer you a great price for it. Well, bro, we got a lot to sell. All right. The birder fly. Okay, so we're starting with 2750 bucks. Let's see how much we can sell all this stuff for. There's probably a few things we should keep, but... I'm just going off the current knowledge we have. 
Rupu. Well, sell, sell that too, I guess. Uh, bones are used to make stuff. All right, I'll save that. Actually, I'll save the uh, gum logs too. And the food. You're gonna offer us seventeen thousand eight seventy four. Damn, that's like a very specific. Um, like you know, on the Price Is Right, when someone will be like Tabitha, how much for this can of sardines? Seventeen thousand eight seventy four, Bob. Like Tabitha, it is, it is literally a tin of sardines. Are you sure? Is that Tabitha? I know this is from a different game show, but is that your final answer? God looks at the audience everyone's literally telling her like five dollars <laughs> uh tw 23 million it's like okay tabitha you know sit down okay sounds good very good i'll take these items and here's your 1784 thank you for visiting john's goods john goodman's thanks john all right let's buy that table saw oh that's a table saw cut wood into planks. That'll be 5,200. I'll take it. Very good. Alright, I also want the axe, please. Oh, uh, pickaxe too, yes. That'll be 1,200. Did I buy a fishing license, chat? Yeah, we're buying an axe. This is 1,000, so a little cheaper than 1,200 for the... Uh, for the uh, thingy, for the pickaxe. All right, that's a fishing rod, a rod used for fishing and the like. That'll be twelve sixty. I'll take it. Very good. Thank you for your purchase. All right, we need five hundred more points for the uh, excavation license. We already have a bug net, and how much for the the Barbie? Thirty four thousand dollars. You got to be in. Okay, maybe Tabitha was right. If sardines are are, are seventeen thousand. A small ass tin grill that you could pick up at Walmart for 20 bucks. Jeez. Thanks, Australia. Alright, well, we got that table saw now. Uh, talk to Fletch. I guess we're gonna start cutting down trees. Oh, wait, where, where is she? Oh, here. Yeah, I guess a barbecue. You'd think barbecues in Australia would be like saunas in Finland. Like, there should be more barbecues than people. Oh, you bought a table saw. Well done. You, uh, don't you think having John here is great? Yes, I do. He's the only one who can sell me stuff. It's the only choice I have. If only we could convince John to move here permanently, dot, dot, dot. I know what you mean, Fletch. I understand permanently. Hmm. Well, let's worry about getting the materials needed for a permanent building first table saw is a great first step for now you can have a break come back and talk to me when you're ready oh yeah i was just reminded to chat we're very close to 3,500 members i forget i don't know what the exact tally is but we're very very close and we'll start doing some special stuff so start the chatter on the discord on what you guys think i should play what you might want to play me with me something we might do in real life if you'd like to see that that'd be kind of cool um Currently, YouTube says we're at uh, 3,456, so we're less than 50 away. It's going to be awesome. All right, uh, let's go for... What, we're just here to make money now? Oh, did I drop all those? Beautiful. Look at blueberry. What is that, a quandong? All right, we need to do stuff for merit points. What do we need to do? We need to do catch three bugs... Gather nine flowers and plant a tree seed. I guess we got to cut down a tree first, then. All right, we're gonna cut you down and plant a new one. Uh, if you don't put down the main camp, and time will stay at twelve, and you can explore the whole island and grab the stuff without the day ending. Oh, really? Oh, an exploit. Cool. And this happened. Yeah, I did notice that the time stood still at one point while I was doing that. I did have the idea, but that's too fun. I mean, that, that takes out too much fun. 
Oh, maybe I... Do I need a shovel to plant the gum nut? Yeah, there must be something else to the puzzle. Okay. Yeah, I must need a shovel. There's an armored vehicle update coming out for Gunsmith. Oh. A lot of you guys are t coming up with like cool, crazy updates and stuff. Please do send me an, uh, a Discord message of any game you want me to play or like of any update or something coming out. That is awesome. You guys are like telling me all sorts of updates like every day. So please, please do uh, DM me on the Discord and just remind me of something you think would be cool on the channel or something that we've talked about that now has a release date or any anytime you guys got some uh, 411 realize that maybe not everybody knows what that means if you got any info there you go feel free to share on the discord hope you're having a good day raptor i am daniel i'm having a great day okay we need to capture two more bugs and can i mine this oh yeah There's barrels on the island. Of course, we can mine these now for coal and things, but... Oh, crocodile. Go get a couple more bugs. We're going to do the quest. Valley F Ferris Suite, that's where I was today. If you guys haven't already checked my Instagram and Twitter, please do follow me on Instagram and Twitter. D do a lot of great posts about, uh, you know, cool places in the world, food, helicopters, battle tanks... Uh, some of which I've driven in real life. There's videos and pictures of me driving tanks and crushing cars and doing all sorts of fun stuff, so please do follow me. Where'd the Fortnite sound go? It's gone. There's all new sound effects. And we're adding more pretty soon. There should be 14 new ones added in total tomorrow, with more on the way. So again, if you have ideas on something you want for a sound effect, please do uh, send a DM. We'll see what we can do. Okay, so I'm like vaguely looking for bugs while I'm also looking for enemies that might jump out. And those flowers that we need. Oh, here's one here. We need like nine of those. Oh, cool. Task complete, 345. You need an oof sound effect? Oh, yes, let's do the oof sound effect from Minecraft. Like when you're taking damage in lava. Ooh, oh, ooh, oh. I like that one. Reminder, this is a bear-free environment. Yes, yes it is. Uh, YouTube Royal 86. I don't know you, but you can have $2, because why not? Thanks, dude. Very nice of you. Thank you very much. I don't know either, but I you either, but I appreciate the uh, kindness. Thank you very much. That was nice. Thank you. Wow, what a nice person that was. Okay, we gotta go find some more bugs. Oh, what was the other task? Bugs and oh, plant a tree. Yeah. Wait, did we do the bug one? No, we're a third of the way there. Ah, oh, boy. Well, sometimes I don't pick up all those things. Oh, well, we'll find them. If I miss something, we'll always come back later. I mean, we live here. We're going to see it. He's looking at all the death over there. Oh, butterfly. Yeah. Oh, butterfly. Nice. Can you fish in this game? Yes, you can. Thanks, dude, for another two. Uh, we do have a fishing pole. I've not done it yet, though. So we have yet to see how that's going to work. All right, so the last thing to do is bury a tree, plant a tree, go back to, uh, where's our base camp? Head north. Raptor's been playing for an hour and nothing has poisoned him. Very poor representation of Australia. <laughs> really? Well, I mean, there is a toxic waste barrel here. 
There's always a chance. Glass bulb, tin sheet, old spring. Oh, that's true. I did, I did get bitten by a shark. Are sharks, like, venomous in Australia? I just imagine, like, crocs carry guns that shoot poisonous bullets, maybe. But you guys know how it is, right? Like, al it's always the small animals that are the most toxic. It's like, oh, this is the microscopic beetle of uh, such and such. One drop of poison can kill three billion people. Like, wow. Does it need to be that mean? Yes. You know what's going to happen one time is that somebody's going to... Uh, something's going to happen where like we're going to launch a space shuttle to Mars. And it's going to like explode. Everyone's going to think it's going to blow up over Earth. But what will happen is that like the capsule with the uh, astronauts in it will just like break off. And like the pilots will land in Australia somewhere. And they'll maybe be in cryogenic freezing, so, you know, they'll be preserved for like a thousand years, and then they'll wake up in Australia thinking they're on like a future terraformed Mars, and they'll just think that everything went horribly wrong. And so they're just going to be on like, it'll, they'll be on Earth, but it'll be Australia, but they'll think it's Mars, and they'll just think that like we were taken over by aliens. The, uh, the Mars settlement. Well, that sounds like a good movie premise. Sounds comedy, but I feel like a lot of, um, you know how, like, a lot of the people who are comedians are also very good at drama? Like, um, you know, Robin Williams. We miss you, Robin. Robin Williams was very good in, like, a one-hour photo, very creepy and stuff. Same with, like, um, uh, when Jim Carrey played, um, some other more serious characters. Or even, um, Adam Sandler. I feel like the, the the comedy guys are the best at drama. Yeah, I miss Robin Williams too, I know. We miss you, Robin. Oh, there's the shark. Patrick, you stay away. Jerk. Okay, let... Oh, I need to talk to you. Oh, God, God I didn't mean to hit you in the knees. Can I buy this thing? Shop closed, you son of a... When do you close? Eight to four... Oh my... Oh my god. Really, bro? You better run, John. I can kill you. Alright. Only animals can kill in Australia. It's like a law. Alright, well, I tried. Well, I guess we can cut down more trees and try that table saw. And then we can uh, maybe replant these trees? Yeah, there was a good drama movie that uh, I think... Uh, Jim Carrey was in called... Um, oh, I, oh, man, I forgot the name of it. Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind or something? Or do you guys remember when, um... Oh, wait. Uh, I need food. I lost my train of so I thought. I'll, maybe I'll think of it. Do we need to eat? Also, in this game, you can only eat so many times, so you can't, like, really exploit your energy. You only eat so many times per, like, time period. build a table can I build a table saw in here seems like it go good next to the crafting table 
Oh, they won't let me. They won't let me build in there. Eternal. Oh uh, yeah, I, re I remember a friend showing me that. That was good. And there's been some really weird movies that come out of nowhere that are really good too. Like for example, the um. Well, like, for example, uh, Heavyweights with Ben Stiller, although that was a comedy, it was, like, beyond. What's up, Sal uh, Savior? How you doing, dude? Can I build it here, then? Alright, we'll put the table saw down. Okay, so we should be able to make a bunch of planks, then. It doesn't take energy to do. I'm a little, a little tired, chap, from a big day, so... I love those sounds. All right, well, let's make a bunch of planks so we can start making our uh, buildings. We'll make like seven more. There we go. There we go. Good, good, good. Do I have any crafting recipes? Rap saw the first big preview for Farthest Frontier. It looks awesome. Uh, yep, they emailed me today. Got a lot of good emails today. I was able to check them on my phone uh, about upcoming games that want to get me in early and let us take an f early first look. I always like when uh, devs let us in early for things because then... Um, I feel like it's, uh, there's a lot of games, like Dinkum, the game we're playing now is one of these games too, where it's like, there's a lot of content to unpack in a game where you're kind of like building and gathering and stuff. So it's like, if you were to try to make a video on Minecraft just to tell everybody what to do, it could be possible, but it'd take forever to showcase. And so, to be able to do it live before a game comes out is good, because otherwise, <laughs> sometimes a video would never come out if you, if you were trying to showcase all the stuff there is to do. I don't see any storage here. Is there a way to unlock stuff? Gotta be in our little handy dandy notebook, right? Any more milestones? Shellfish lover. Creepy dink. It's all good. Haha. <laughs> Looks like we got everything else. We had to plant a tree, but, uh, what's his name? Closed, like we were like a minute late. I was being too carefree. Oh, well. Oh, boy. You think I'm being a tomato? I know. My, I certainly do look very sunburned. It's it's not as uh, bad as it looks in the mirror, anyway. Maybe the camera accentuates that. We'll see tomorrow when, you know, my epidermis just falls off. Okay, let's uh, build a button board. Who needs this many buttons? Old toy, toy with button. Oh, that's like an old game. Oh, a key. Probably open something, dot, dot, dot. All right, time to cook some food. Uh, what's up, Valnor? Yeah, when I came back from the, um, from dinner, well, when I came back from the amusement park just to take a quick break, the construction crews were still working, but it looked like they were wrapping up. Then when I went out for dinner, it looks like they were kind of loaded up and rolling out. When I, when I came back, finally, they were all gone, so internet could still go down at any time, but 
it's a small chance of that. Raptor can talk so much faster with the new internet. Oh yeah. Yeah, the new internet makes my brain smart good now. Finally. All right, uh, let's see. Oh, eating a cactus fig will negative five health, but plus two on energy. What does it do when it's cooked? Just five energy, nice. That's good though. Like you certainly want this when you're doing a hard day of logging, mining, especially probably shoveling. Moving dirt is heavy. Cheers for streaming. Uh, I love you guys. Yeah, yeah. I didn't want to. I didn't want to go a day with just without streaming. I can. I can do both. Hanging out with you guys ain't even a big deal. It's easy to hang out and stream. Videos are hard. Streaming is a little easier. We get to hang out, make jokes. And it's kind of more of a rela relaxed pace oftentimes because, you know, I mean, Dinkum, even though there's lots to do and lots to build, there's no rush in this game. You don't want this game to be, uh... You don't want this game to, like, be stressful. Do you know what I mean? I'm sure there's probably going to be a better way to cook all this food, but, you know, we'll just plant a little bit. Did I miss you? I did, yeah. That's why I shared all this stuff online. I was going to live stream from the uh, park at some... Uh, I was going to stream from the park, too, but, uh, eh. You had to, like, take all your stuff and put it in a backpack every so often, you know? It's like, eh. Meh. I enjoy myself. What is it? Oh, Old Spring. Okay. Uh, we're playing this on PC, but uh, I don't know if there's plans yet for the game to go anywhere else. But right now, just PC. So it is available now on Steam. It is multiplayer. It does have combat. There is building. There is farming. There's, uh... I don't know if there's PvP combat against other players, but... That certainly would be something cool if they added that in. It'd make it like Rust. Looks like it's made for Switch. It does, yeah. That's just the art style choice. I think it's a good choice. Right, our character needs a little nap time now. Are there bears? This is actually a bear-free environment, so thanks to everybody for keeping it bear-free. Thanks. Thanks, chat. No, that's a lot of damage! No. I love the noises. Game is also currently on sale, ten percent off until July twenty first. Oh yeah, that's that's a good that's a good uh, price, I think, from what I've seen. All right, I think John will be gone. Oh, John's back. Good. Well, that that's fine. Then we can go straight to him and buy that shovel. And what are our tasks for today? Smash four rocks, craft two items, collect seven shells. What are the boards? 70, 20, 60. Oh, you want the... The guy from one military camp to be voiced by Arlie Ermey? Yeah. I know what you mean. Too bad. Legend. I don't want to sell anything else. It could be used for building, but we'll sell the bugs. They usually sell for a good price. Yeah, 1,860, 70, that's good. All right, let's buy a shovel. Oh yeah, we gotta to talk to Fletch first. got another job for you. Are you up for it? Let me quickly apply for a license first so I don't forget. Good. 
And we'll say, ooh, metal detecting. Allows the holder to buy a metal detector. I would like that. Who's buying the bugs? Uh, I'm assuming that all this stuff's being sold back to South City where we started. Where everyone's all sad and whatnot. And uh, people are probably willing to pay a high price for, you know, bugs and, you know, anything with color. Anything that would interest them. You know what I mean? Okay, so let's do... So there's still hunting, farming, landscaping, building, and vehicle license. Oh yeah, we get a, we get vehicles in the game too. That's another cool feature. Badass. Uh, John, I'm here for my shovel. The big st spoon for dirt and stuff. Okay. And at 35,000, we unlock the grill. Oh, we're supposed to mine three rocks, four rocks, and like seven shells. Ooh, shiny stone. Dude, the uh, harmonica in this is awesome. Reminds me of some of the Miyazaki animes. What oh, did that cover the goal? Yep. Cool. How was the fair? Great, Kyle. Great. Yeah, lots of photos and stuff on the Instagram today. Well, I'll be putting more on the Instagram. A lot more on Twitter, so make sure you follow me there. Lots of cool stuff there, too. Okay, so if I use the pickaxe... Looks like it just gives a bone. Okay, craft two items and collect seven shells. Let's go to the shells. There's a shore there we could go to. Dinkum dinkum, yes indeed. Shark's got to be around here somewhere. Am I sure? I'm pretty sure, yeah. Nice. May have gathered most of them, though. There we go. Cool. And now we just have to craft two items. Alright, we're going straight north. A tire? Uh, what can we get rid of? Eat some of this.
We need to make a storage box. We don't have a recipe for it though. Oh, we found a green board. Has things on it. Oh, a CD. Shiny disc. I can see myself. Yeah, this is why it seems like post-apocalyptic or something. As if they don't know what these things are. Okay, stones are easy. Old wheel. That seems rare. Uh, where are we going? We follow the coastline. Take a left. Could be a good spot to build a bridge. You think it's a PS2 disc? Oh boy. Probably some PlayStation classics on that one, right chat? This game needs bears. This is a bear-free environment, sir. Leave your bears outside. A wooden torch. A crude fence. Need resin for that. The ultimate goal here? Well, I would imagine the ultimate goal is to just build like a town and survive and, you know, simulate the whole town building where people would arrive and more houses would be built and then, f you know, food production increases and then we can sell things for money. Kind of works that way. Probably also going to be a farmer, so there's a little bit of uh, Stardew Valley in there. And uh, I guess the real goal is just to have a good time. One's in the chat if you're having a good time. Is anyone here having a time that is good? Okay, we got to gather some stone, I think. Should have thrown that stone out. We'll go sell all this stuff to our neighbor. John. Jahan. Then we have room for stone. used to love PS1 demo discs. You found Cool Borders 2 and Gex Enter the Gecko that way? Yeah. I guess that's what YouTube videos are nowadays, right? Back in the day, we had to rely on, uh, you know, PlayStation demo discs and PC Gamer demo disc, And just demos were the things that sold games because people didn't even know about them until they tried out a demo but now it's like you can watch a free YouTube video and be like oh this game looks cool and then pick it up if you want or uh, buy it when it's on sale Jerry thanks for the three dude appreciate the support thank you very much hope I enjoyed the day at the amusement park I did I posted some photos on Instagram and Twitter and I'll be posting more probably tomorrow and throughout the week and maybe after I get a haircut too I need one. Oh, we have uh, tin ore, so we can definitely make uh, aluminum. <laughs> aluminum. I mean bronze. Sorry, I'm a little sleepy. Okay. Um, so we're just going to craft a couple of items. So now we have... hundred and some, uh, 300 something there. Nobody would read the magazines that they came in? No, it was all about the demo discs. Cool. Now we have 405. Excellent. Oh, now we can make a nice path between our and the neighbor's house. Let's cut down some trees and make some nice pathways now. 
Make a neighborhood we can be proud of. Let's redo our inventory. Let's do X. Uh, pickaxe. Shovel. Butterfly shovel, yeah. Did you ever subscribe and receive Lego magazines? Hell yeah, I did. I don't remember the name of that magazine. Wasn't it like kind of smaller? I think it was like a... I was like a... Kind of like a little book rather than a magazine. Maybe it was a full-size magazine, but damn, when that Lego magazine came in the mail, damn. Oh my god. And then I think the Lego Island uh, game also kind of... Oh, it's called Lego Creator Magazine? Damn. They should still make that. I noticed they're coming out with a Lego uh, playset for the office, which seems pretty cool. Do we, have, do we have a quest with Fletch? Oh, maybe we do, yeah. Let's go chat with her. Oh yeah, she has another job. Yeah, I'm ready. Uh, camping is fun, but if we're going to convince people to stay here, we got to start building more permanent structures. I've noticed there's a lot of tin ore on the island. You know, popping up on rocks all over the place. We can melt it down into great stuff for building. Now I need to bring me some items. One campfire, three stone, and ten tin ore. Keep in mind you'll need a mining license. Once you've gathered everything, come and see me. Okay, cool. Ah. Uh, this will save you thanks to the five. <laughs> I invite you to Google Drop Bear. Oh, God. Let's find tin ore. Is tin ore anywhere? Or do we have to look for... Like, does it... Can you see it in the rocks, or can it just be anywhere? Or Nintendo Power? Hell yeah. You want the cooked ones, though. Actually, those give health and energy. The Alright, bush limes are very good for combat, it seems. They'll restore energy, and they'll restore health. Snakes and spiders. God. That, too. I'm full. Oh, it's the black things coming out of the rocks? Okay. I thought maybe it'd be a random chance to drop. All right. Uh, well, we know, well, there's quite a few places to go mine, so. Well, looks like we can find them at random. Oh, it looks like we're going to need a thousand bucks, too, like every couple days to buy tools from John because there's not a way to make them yet. Okay, so we have four tin ore. Raptor, I posted a legal magazine on Discord in the members only chat. Oh, I think you mean Lego. Ooh, quartz. Yeah, we found quartz. Back for that. I assume what she's probably going to have us make is a, uh, maybe a smelter. You meant legal magazine? What? Interesting. Oh, you, you meant Lego. Okay. Gotcha. Alright, and then we just gotta go back and make a quick little... Gotta go back and make a little campfire now. Yeah, Lego are awesome, man. It's really cool to see uh, how creative the Lego... <coughs> it's kind of cool whenever the Lego people make a new Lego set because you kind of have to see... How creative they have to be when they make a Lego set. Like you can see them trying to use Lego pieces that somehow geniusly work out. Like sometimes they could get away with using a simple block, but they use like two complicated blocks. And you're like, why would they do that? And it's like, well, yeah, because I'm building a 
I'm building a blacksmith shop. No wonder they did that, because that would be cooler to have, like, an anvil that looks like this rather than just the one-piece anvil. That should work. All right, let's go uh, turn these into fletch. Then we need to make a campfire again, though. Oh, actually, we can do that at the crafting table over here. You just bought the blacksmith Lego set? Hell yeah. I've been wanting to buy that, too, but uh, I know what's going to happen. I bought Lego sets, and we put them together on the stream before. That was fun. Although the webcam was a little crappy for it. didn't do it justice. But hey... You can enjoy Lego at anybody can enjoy any Lego at any age. Any interests. Cool how they're for everybody. They've done a good job of trying to make something for everybody. Everything from like cool little like fire department sets and trains and construction sites to like Indiana Jones stuff and Um Yeah. Okay, I think we're good. I need everything. Uh, we're on day three. But, I guess we're in no rush. I mean, the faster we beat things, the faster we don't get to play the game anymore. What's up, Kovalane? How you doing? Welcome aboard. How's the search going? Have you found all the items? Uh... I did? And I'm still looking. Oh, did I not? No, one out of one. Oh, one out. Oh, I need extra stones. Two more stones. There we go. Hi, ma'am. Well done. I knew I could count on you to find everything we need. Here's a recipe for a crude furnace. Uh, why don't you do try crafting the crude furnace at the crafting table in the base tent? Uh oh Once you've created a crude furnace, pop it on the ground outside somewhere. Then just place the ore inside of it. It'll take a while to do its thing, so feel free to do other activities while it's melting. Interesting. Bring me the tin bar when you're ready, okay? You mean Tim Burr, the guy who cuts down trees? Always shout, shouts his name every time a tree falls? Alright, let's make a crafting bench crude furnace. Pockets are full. Great. And John just quit for the day because it's now past four. Oh, I need those stones. We'll get rid of the grass seeds. Yeah. Love that crafting sound. Very good. Alright, so there's our furnace. So yeah, I like the color coding in this game too. If you haven't noticed, like, items are coded, uh, color coded based on, like, whether they're food or... Uh, like a key item or like a material that we can build with. You think uh, John is a dinkum? Oh. Maybe that's his name, except it's, I think it's Goodman or something. John Goodman? I, I'm pretty sure that's his name. Well, let's build a furnace here then. Wrong way. Try that again. That's better. All right, so then we're just throwing some tin in there, right? One at a time. All right, then we got to take the tin bar to Fletch. Okay, cool. Okay, we need stone to make a nice little pathway.
Oh, I see how this works. Oops. Oh, dirt has to be transported one at a time like that, huh? Okay, interesting. Very interesting. Hmm. We got our quest done, right? Yep. Do we have any more of these? I wonder if I could make a uh, canal by digging some of this out and letting the water go through, making Booster jealous. Might also affect soil fertility. There might be something to actually digging out the ground and uh, increasing the fertility of the soil that way. Oh, there it is. All right. Ma'am. Got what you needed. Well done. You've proven yourself invaluable once again. See? You're really starting to carry a lot of stuff around. I'll tell you what. I'll teach you how to craft a wooden crate. You're going to need a recipe for the nails, too. Tell you what. The Raptory is well on its way to being a great settlement again. With a furnace and a table saw, we can start thinking about building more permanent structures. Uh, we should try and get John to set up a real shop here. Let's do it. That's the spirit. I reckon if we spend a little bit of money at this tent, he'll see it worthwhile. We should show him how friendly people are around here. Ask him if he needs anything done. We can prove to him that new Raptoria is a great place. I'm sure he'll ask to live here for good. Keck W emote. Oh, it's so... Yeah, ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Okay, ma'am. You got it. Nails. Wooden crate. Ugh. Okay, so nails take the tin bar. Oh, we're making tin nails. Pockets full again. She gonna offload stuff in her house. We're not. She didn't want that crap in her house either. Yo, what's up, Dark Fury? How you doing? Welcome to the Big O stream. Let's make nails. Let's make a chest. Or wooden crate. Oh, we need palm wood as well. Interesting. We're going to have to go to the jungle up here. It's a jungle out there. He's right up here. Uh, you've seen a lot of my videos? Thanks, bro, for watching. That's a palm right there. Enemy identified. Okay. 
And we can make planks out of that. Two full. God. There we go. That'll buff out, chat. Okay, now we gotta make plank. Home planks. Do some favors for John and convince him to move in. Alright, well, he's probably here. Let's go see what he's up to. Wait, who the hell? Oh, you both are talking to each other? I've had a big day. It's a good night to just relax. What's up? I've been trying to get rid of excess stock lately. Thing is, I already have the best deals in town, so I haven't adjusted the prices. Oh, ho, ho. wow. Sir? Oof. Nearly as hot as my low, low prices. You wanted to chat? You got jobs, bruh? Do you have a mining license? I think you could help me out. Help me out and rustle up two bags of cement. Uh, it would really help me out. I'll do it. Thank you. Uh, this request must be completed by what? That's it? Oh, I took damage. Yeah. Awesome, taking all that damage actually paid off. A good move, and all according to plan chat, that's a big brain emote. Oh yeah. You can't do cement yet, you don't have the right machine. Oh, it has to be done by the end of the day? Oh. Oh, by the end of the day? Well, GG, bro. I, I didn't... I can do it... No. That's right. He'll either have a new quest or we can do it any time then. If it keeps coming up. Maybe he'll move away forever and our town will be doomed. Doomed, you hear me? Doomed! Well, let's make a box. Table saw here, please. Yeah, that's a good spot for the wooden crate, actually. Ooh. Lots of inventory space. Very nice. Very nice. All right, what are we gonna drop off? Is there a quick transfer button? Shift. Yeah, we'll leave these here. Keep those.
All right, do some favors for John. Well, I guess if we fail one, there'll be many more. Okay, um, do we have any more tin? Could keep smelting that. Plenty. Requires five. Just stepped away. Has he built a Wendy's yet? Uh, I'm working on it, okay? I'm working on it. Mm. Oh boy. Let's just focus on our chores. I don't. I don't want trouble. Let's go talk to John. We're going to find out what else he wants. Did a koala bear maul me? No. We're fine. Hi, John. It would be too much trouble to catch a blue moon butterfly. go catch a blue moon butterfly. Seems like it'd be pretty rare if it comes around once in a blue moon. enough I, I like how bugs and stuff aren't just around at random they seem to be in biomes where they thrive jay led thanks for becoming a raptor egg appreciate your support oh we had to travel 500 meters on foot that's good spent 3,000 dink we should probably do that by buying new stuff yeah with one resident okay You know what that is, chat. New member, welcome. Oh boy. Those guys are mean. Alright, let's, uh, I'm gonna go back into the, where's, where's the best place to just go find these? Probably down here. We're going this way. Yeah, those are angry chickens right there. One angry chicken. We need an extra, like a different name for them, like rage chickens or something. Rage nugs. Yeah, we're out to catch a one. We're out to catch a moon crescent butterfly or something. Rage shadow chickens. Get the game everyone's talking about. Scanning for bugs.
Well, that's you, Lisley. Blue, blue, blissy. It's an armadillo. It'd be cool if John had like three quests that he could take. Want a scavenger hunt now? Oh, wait. Oh, another Ulysses, I think. Oh, there it is. Blue Moon. We got it. We are the. Hello? Ooh. An old sign. We might get to put that in the house. Butterfly, we got it. Got it times two. Got him. Got him times two. All right, let's go home. Convince John to move in. He gets to be a neighbor of me. I would he never. He would never want to leave. I know John. I allow him to live. He's my favorite. For now. In. It looks like the axe has some pretty poor durability. Same with the, uh, the axe and the pickaxe. So I think we're probably going to have to buy, like, maybe two more of each. I don't want to buy too many because now that we have the smelter, we might end up making our own, but it seems like a time saver to... Yep. Do we get an achievement? Smashing! We're breaking our tool. Oh, we gotta go, like, straight east. Well, like, this way. Ugh. Bum, bum, bum. Game seems to have a lot of different gameplay for being early access. Yeah, the dev did a pretty good job of making it, you know, a little bit of this and that. And I'm really happy to see all these other, you know, oftentimes people will say, oh, this is just that or whatnot. And they'll reference something that they don't realize is just a game from somewhere else, like Stardew Valley is basically uh, Harvest Moon. But if they saw Harvest Moon gameplay, then they would immediately be like, oh, dude, Harvest Moon? Co they copied Stardew Valley. It's like, no, one came out before the other. But it's good to see competition in, like, a new genre created, and then somebody else tries to make a game in that genre. Like, for example, uh, SimCity. Now we have City Skylines and uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon. Now we have Planet Coaster and, like, Planet Zoo and stuff, so... Always got to welcome that competition. Otherwise, we end up with Comcast and EA being companies of the year. Imagine that. Yeah, My Time at Portia is another good one, too. That's kind of like this in many ways, too, yeah. Or at least it feels like it. Gives me the good vibes. John here? He is good. Here's Johnny. Oh, hi. Sell goods. Oh, actually, wait. Do I have to turn this quest into him? Here you go. 
Ah, you found the moon butterfly. Bonza. Wow, you really found it. You're the best, Raptor. I owe you one. Take this. Not much, but I hope you like it. A red beanie, which is not red or beanie at all. No. Oh, I can customize myself, but thanks, John. You're the best. Oh, we're supposed to buy new stuff. take the bug net too. Eventually it'll break. And that should be the other one, yep. Chat with one resident. But oh, John's not a resident. Let's see if it works. Chat with one resident. John's not even going to live here permanently. That is, that is a con continuity error. Zero out of ten unplayable. Wow, I'm so mad now. My time is Sandrox25 on Steam. It's a damn good game, too. I like good games. I don't know about you, chat, but good games are good. All right, let's do another job. Yeah, we have, uh, we have cooked cactus figs right here. They're pretty good on the energy. Oh, okay. So we gotta check back with John tomorrow for a new job. And we have a new pickaxe, so let's go looking for tin. How do I wear this? Keep that dome hot. Oh, we can wear it like that. Ah, I see. Oh, God, no. Okay, so you get a hat icon to tell you it's a hat, but the description tells you what it is. Uh, oh. Oh. Croc crossing over there. Yeah, we got the dingo crossing. Or the kangaroo crossing sign. That's cool. That needs to be legally hanging in an outback steakhouse. Or a crocodile Dundee's house. barrels. These barrels seem to have a lot of good stuff in them. Like end game items. Or at least later than we are now. And we got more shells. Good. Oh, we have a bug net. We're uh, gonna sell some s seashells down by the seashore shortly. Oh, and uh, we should get tin too. Forgot about that. I like this game for being littered with stuff, but you just gotta eventually know what's valuable and not. And or come back a different day because you don't... <coughs> Sorry, you don't have enough capacity of storage. And so you gotta make new stuff. Wait, the Oregon Trail's the oldest... And longest running series of 51 years? You mean gaming? Uh, yep. Plants can be chopped down and then replanted. Pretty cool. Should do that with lemon trees now. 
or a cactus. We can put a cactus to work for us. Oh. Bro, I want a Galapagos turtle. Oh, there it is. Hi, turtles. Oh, they're so majestic. Look at them. Wow. I'm kidding. We all know those are coyotes. Nothing. Nothing there to mine. Uh oh. One of those damn birds is nearby. Sir, could you just leave me alone? You found a couple of cactuses in your backyard in Ohio. Apparently they're native too. Wow. That bird is not going to go away, is he? It's like he's protecting a nest and then we're just like leading him away. Okay, I'll well, just go mine flint over here then. That's a murder bird. Oh boy, now it's coming for me. Bird a bird. Uh, well, this could be like predator now. Bird's gonna be chasing me the whole time. Cloaking himself through the forest. Yeah, descendants of raptors, that's what I hear. Lies, chat. Absolute lies. Okay. back home-ish. Do I like this game? Yeah. I was going to play it again earlier, but I kind of ran out of time and had to play some other stuff on the channel, but damn good game. I'd love to play some multiplayer soon. You want to hear the whistle song from members, but only if one gets dropped. 
Okay. Yeah, if somebody drops a, a big old member bomb in the chat, we usually play that. the tin we have 16 tin ore that's pretty good oh yeah because we have to insert it and he was still going the last time we were nearby so we're going to have to kind of wait a while. Uh oh. I heard a third set of... Po I, th I thought I heard footprints. What's up, Evan? How you doing? What brings you on here on this hot day? I wish I could be more of help to you. I'll tell you what, old Fletch wasn't always too old. He used to run around helping people out just like you. Always doing something. Oh. Okay. You want to hang out? She's like, nah. Oh. Uh, Fletch thinks about that by doing favors. Oh, that's something else. Uh, collect tin bar one. Bring it to Fletch again. Oh, we're kind of already underway. This is for you. The tin bar. Yeah. You really found a tin bar. You're the best. Are you one? Take this. Ooh, a thousand bucks. Thank you very much, ma'am. Good cash. One step close to that grill. Ooh. You have a grill in our inventory? No. to for those points. <sighs> ah, boy. 31 degrees Fahrenheit for you, or Celsius? Wow, that's high. We got a crock. So let's do a little fishing. We haven't done that at, at all. Let's try to do some fishing. Hmm. 
<sighs> Reel in or cancel? Um... I think we gotta wait for like a a group of fish to be around. Oh, do we need bait? Yeah, we might need to click and click and drag it on the actual line. Okay, there we go. What time is it for me? Uh, 9.30. Oh, it's only 7 o'clock. What do we got for points? Almost 2,000. Pretty cool to be on the goals and stuff and get them done. Do a little good old fashioned mining, brother. And the water sounds so nice. Don't mind me, just doing some munching. Hi Amanda, welcome to the chat. And we gotta sell birds and butterflies to our neighbor. I think we can sleep. All these goodies. Let's go to the neighbors then. All right, we're going to say hi to John. What's up, bro? John just wants us to get him something to eat. Okay. Um, I have a cactus fig. Lowers your health. Good. Oh no, I don't really like stuff like this. You can have it back. I don't think I'm hungry anymore. What? Damn it. How are you supposed to know what he... Oh, okay, must have to have been cooked. Damn it. Oh, that's kind of cool, though. <clears throat> They'll ask for stuff, but then you got to kind of figure out what they want. 
So there must be a way to know that. Oh, this is our relationship with him so far? Okay. Okay, makes sense. That's kind of cool. Grubhub with Amazon? That's what we should do with him. Still go sell some stuff to him. The butterflies and stuff. want to sell. There we go. Ooh. Okay, not bad. About a thousand bucks for that. Very cool. Very cool. And thanks for dropping in. Very nice. All right, we'll have to keep checking in with John to get him happy to move in with us. All right, let's do some fishing. There's a fish. Oh, boy. Well, we can see in the water, so we must have to get over a position. I want to try out fishing. Our first look at the fishing minigame. I think I know what they want. Butterfly. Another blue moon. Bum, bum. Yeah, gator hunting is cool. I got plans for those gators, chat. Believe me. Oh, it's more quartz. Let's see. All right, we're going this way. Looking for tin, mostly. Do I like the energy system or no? Yeah, it's kind of cool. <clears throat> it's strategic, and then you can kind of plan for things. Like, the more you play, you can kind of figure out how much certain things that you want to do will cost for energy, and then you can just bring and have food ready to kind of counteract it later on. Kind of cool. Lots of stone here. I, I guess we should start mining stone, although tin might be a little better. All right, notes itself, light a fire on the beach. Wow, I'm trapped all alone on this desert island. Oh no. Oh 
All right, we're looking for tin. And maybe butterflies. These, wait, this, they have gold? No. There we go. Okay, we need five more. I think eventually we should set up more furnaces, but... We'll see if there's an upgrade one soon. Basic crafting idea right there. Tin should be everywhere. Oh, I forgot I could start marking the maps too. Don't go Lord of the Flies on us. I feel like that would only happen in like PvP. If somebody kills you, you'd go like... You'd go vengeance. Oh, a jellyfish. Poisoned! Yeah! We're poisoned to death, chat. Awesome. Now we're gonna die. My kids say you're super cool and play the best games. Kids are smart. Genius kids. Pull them out of school so they, they can watch the channel full time. Cool. Couple stash items. Look, chat. Flying coconuts. Pineapples, I mean. All right, let's get some more shells and then we'll see if we can go mine more tin. What are those flowers? Got the game. Looks fun. Can't wait to play it tomorrow. I think we should do like a community uh, server. I don't know if you can host dedicated servers, but regardless, it could be a cool thing to do where we can all play this. I got some ideas to uh, maybe for us all to play uh, all guys again for the um, 3,500 member milestone. Did I swap something to make room for the Ulysses butterfly? Yes. Drop the, uh... I gotta make another box, dude. Drop the nanners. Nanners and... Oh, those stones are going to be useful. I'll just drop the grass seed. You just got the game to... What? Wow, so many of you guys are just buying the game tonight. That's awesome. I hope you guys enjoy. The stream isn't sponsored or anything, so uh, that just means solely that everybody's having a good time watching and we'll uh, maybe check out the game. That's cool. Love when you guys find out about new games through the channel. And it's super cool when you guys buy the games because you like what you see enough to check it out even further on your own. That's really cool.
And James A. giving a 10 bomb in the chat. Thank you very much, James from Mexico. Awesome. Thank you very much. Perfect. Thank you very much, dude, for your support, bro. Guy. I'm just kidding. It's Jessica B. Thank you, Jessica, for the big O10 bomb. Show Jessica some love in the chat. Gift bombs all around. And if you got a membership from Jessica, make sure you go ahead and say thank you. That's awesome, bud. We have to play some more games together, Jessica. But it's been too long. I'd I'd grab from these barrels, but we're full right now. Except for these things, will stack. Sir, could you go away? I really okay. I can't. I really don't want to use my axe to attack him. If I can throw rocks. Well, I could try to lure him away. Whoa. Looks like he gave up pursue. Okay, now he's back. Sir? Can you craft weapons later to deal with animals? Yep. We'll have to buy a license for that, but it is something we can definitely do. That must be how to fish, is to find a fish in the water. Now there's two of them. Now there's none. Better not give quartz. It will, won't it? Sir... All right, mining, they must be able to hear. Oh. They can't m walk across that. Uh, these are, these are death emus. Actually, I wonder if it says what these are. Oh, God, I better not read live. I know what they are, but I wonder if it says, like, what they are. Yeah, I think he finally gave up. Oh, maybe I have to, like, hunt one first. Basically, you gotta go this way. Hey, dude, play the song. Oh, what song? Oh, oh, the, the Ride the Train song. Thank you, dude. The reminder. Thank you, dude. Hold on, butterfly. Hey, dude, play the song. Yeah, brother, yeah. Um, trade bones for now. Goodbye, bones. Oh, yeah. 
All right, back to base. We had a lot of stuff to offload. I probably need to build more storage. go oh there's the tent kind of suspicious to see death pits laying around on the shore like that must be for the crocs crocodile death pit that's a sweet metal band oh wait he's basically about to close hold on there we go Yeah, brother, yeah. We got here just in time. Sweet, worth it bringing me back and all. Yeah, yeah. Thank you very much, Levi, for the five. And then another five. Champion, dude. Absolute winner right here. Cool, 2,000 bucks. And I'm leaving too. Good day, good night. All right, so let's talk to Fletch real quick. Oh wait, no, not not for hanging out. Wait, will she not sell licenses? Let's chat. Town Awards, Happiness, Amenity, Beauty, Museum, Economy, and License. Yeah, eventually we can invite people to the city, and then we can actually make the uh, city happy too, not just like they move in. That's one of the steps. But right now we're a zero star city, zero chap. Nobody likes our, nobody likes our city, no one hit the like button on our city. They hate it. Yeah, we'll need to make a couple more of those furnaces. Ah, uh, we need palm wood for the other storage. Um... Going this way should be should be fine. Devori, I I hat you. I think you mean you hate me, but I don't think that's true. I think you're just here to like get attention or say hi or something. So hello, we're all here for attention, even me. So thanks for being a part of our streams. It's cool. We got a good chat here. So uh, again, if you're all new here, don't forget to say hello in the chat. Feel welcome to ask me a question or say hi or tell me about a video that you liked on the channel or something. And um, happy to answer your questions about this game or any other game. Hello, Blayla. Good to see you back. Hello. Hello, hello. Oh, and uh, chat. You haven't forgotten to uh, follow me on Instagram, have you? With the links down below in the description. See all the cool, awesome stuff I was up to today. Grounded is being made into a movie series? No way. That's awesome. Is it going to be animated or live action or what? Dude, I really want them to do live action. I think animation is too easy. I'd love to see what they come up with. Bum, bum. 
Oh, I need to plant a tree. We can get new tasks. Uh. Oh yeah, that's true. We can uh, make a palm. We can make a palm farm now. Now that we transported the seed back here. Wait, I, m I might have more palm seeds. up all these uh, palm woods. And Levi with the big O10. Thank you very much, dude. Troll, where? Get him and thank you Jess for the member bomb. I was wanting to hear the song and even got more out of it. Say hi guys and lurking is also welcome. Yeah, true. Uh, have you played the game It Takes Two? Requires two players but is fun as hell. Ref finished a run of it. Uh, no, I do know that's on Game Pass for free though, but I, I did want to do that with like Alex or somebody sometime. A little older of a game. Not like too old, but... Oh uh, yeah, that's definitely one that I'd love to play. Tomorrow, though, chat, Stray comes out, which uh, is a game about being like a lost cat or something like that, but there's a little bit more to it than just that, and apparently it's been getting cool reviews and a lot of... There's been a lot of YouTubers that somehow got access to it, and people are really liking what it's all about. You think it's just Cat Simulator, and it certainly is. Like, you can push bottles and mugs and glasses and things off cabinets and the countertops and whatnot and be a dastardly little cat, but a little bit more to it, so we're going to probably play that tomorrow. And it'll probably be at noon, because I don't think it comes out till midday, and then uh, he'll let loose in the PM um, when Buford T. Gamer is home. Oh, is Fletch gone? I still need to buy licenses and stuff from her. Right, how do I plant a uh, how do I plant a palm seed? Do I need the shovel to do it? Or do I just hit E? No. Oh, you got to dig it a lick. Oh, you got to do it a layer down. Okay. Wait, do I just wait? Do I just drop it? Oh, you need a hoe to do it. Oh. We need the farming license. Or can I just bury it? I can't do this, can I? Oh, what? Oh, cool. That worked. Cool. So now we got all of our... Thing he's done awesome that's neat all right so we're gonna try to next thing we should do is yeah move the palm trees closer because i do want to make um more storage we need more storage for our town dude this is cool like everything that we've seen here today so far is cool but i think the game really begins once we've once we've started to actually make a town and people live here and then there's stuff for us to build that's like a fountain and pathways and bridges and chicken coops and, you know, whatever else we kind of create. That'll be cool. All right, so we have another box ready to go. I think I actually had more nails in the box, but... Yeah. Well, that's fine. Oh, 
All right. All right, there's going to be no organization really for a little while. I'm just going to throw everything everywhere for a little bit. Off to a good start for five days. I feel like it. I mean, you know, we could be here for a thousand days. It's not really a race, as they say. We just take our time. Yeah, it looks like straight releases for me noon tomorrow. So the stream will be a couple hours later than it usually is. Otherwise, I won't have anything to play. Well, let's go for another day. Oh, boy. Oh, that shows us all what we sold. Yeah, cool. John is visiting the island. Imagine that. He's been here every day. Alright, John, what else you got for a quest? Oh, and we got a new quest, too. Smash three ore rocks. Easy. Cook two fruit. Easy. Harvest twelve bottle brush. That I've not seen before. Um. Hey, what's up, Soulswind? How was the day out of the amusement park? The pictures definitely indicate lots of excitement. It was great. The weather was really hot, probably the hottest day of the year, but it made going on those water rides awesome. There's some really cool ones that I missed. and uh, I, I hadn't been in that amusement park for like five years. I planned to go like two or three years ago, but you know what happened, so couldn't do what I wanted to do. Allows the holder to notice some buried items using sight all allo? Sight al I think it means also, but a typo maybe. Hmm. Well, let's do a farming license. That'll make us money. Ooh, a scythe. Nice. Very scythed about that. Grain mill? Ooh. Okay, so the licenses also give us new crafting recipes, so that's cool. Alright, the hunting license will probably give us a 4x4 truck. And a shotgun. Oh. A cricket bat. We got a cricket bat, a spear, and a basic hammer. Okay, then. Building license. Oh, for simple bridges. Ooh. Yeah, it was good times. It was good times at the amusement park. Ooh, a brick bridge. Nice. All right, so that's going to be easier ways across the rivers. That's cool. A tool belt license. Expand your tool belt slot by one. Take that. Um, raise, wait, buy and raise chooks? No idea what that is. Ban pocket storage by three. I'm gonna do that. Gonna help me for a million years. You can drive boats. Oh, yeah. Do landscaping. Brick path, stone path, cement path, cement steps, palm wood path. Oh, my God. Chooks or chickens? Oh. Wrapping license, that must be for capturing them. Uh, animals successfully dropped off will give a reward. Hey, what's up, Wolverine95? Good to see you. Alright, we got a lot of stuff we can make now. Dude, we unlocked a ton of stuff. Let's go check in with John now for other quests. Uh, 
Uh, I think you can find me some clothing. Anything new in my wardrobe would be welcome. Okay. I don't know what that means, but... It has to be done by the end of the day, otherwise he'll give us a new one. So if we fail, it's fine. We don't have the stuff. No harm, no fall. You want me to give him our hat? Yeah. Oh, it, it will work. Okay. Ooh, he gave us pants in exchange for a hat. Nice. Oh, now we have actual pants. Cool. Now we wear the pants in this family chat. Yeah! Literally, upgrade. Are we running, like, way faster? What's going on? I feel like we're running so much faster. Are these pants giving us a boost, or is it just because we got plenty of energy? Well, we did some favors for John. Let's see if we can convince him to move in. Dude, it seems like we're just going turbo. Well, would you like to move in, John? I've decided I really like it here. I spoke to Fletch and I've applied for a deed so I can set up a permanent store here in town. Hope I can move in soon. A new deed is available. Talk to Fletch to apply for deeds. Uh, there we go. Hello there. What can I do for you? Uh, let's talk about the town. Let's see. What exactly can I help you with? Can I see the deeds? A shop deed. 75,000. And it requires materials. Bulletin board. Okay. Oh, is she can upgrade the house too? Oh no. She can upgrade our house. It's going to be a Tom Nook situation. Hostage. Oh boy. Alright, smash some ore, cook some fruit, and harvest 12 bottle brush thingies. I have no idea where those are going to be. I have no idea. Place the deed you pay after? Well, I still need the money for John to move in, though, right? Also, I don't know where I'm going to put his house. Uh, hi. Okay, we're gonna apply for the shop deed. Just so you know, this will put the town in seventy-five thousand in debt. There's a donation box here at the base tent. Oh, I see. And then we need materials too. Okay. 
Why, that's actually cool. means people in the town can pay a tax to get a store. Eventually. Pay a deed for that guy to move in. Ah, that's pretty cool. I place materials inside. Never mind. Okay, so we can bl basically buy blueprints and then fill them in as we go. That's kind of cool. Then you can work on stuff over uh, longer periods of time. Okay, we need to mine minerals. I know there's some up here. Let's go do that. Uh, question. In 11 or 12 days when I have six months membership, will I get my red eye? I can't wait for that one. I to join the Blue Eye Club. Yeah, six months. Uh, yeah, if, if, if you're if you're going to be six months in a few days, then you can basically, it'll be automatic. And you can be eligible for the new color. Smash three ore rocks. Quartz is an ore, right? Mm, it's a crystal. It doesn't count. What's up, Baltimoreals? Good to see you. Well, we have more trees we can cut down. Luckily, no burbs. Oh, is that a seed? Oh, there it is. Got it. Gum tree wood is pretty common because it's always sitting on the ground. Or in other words, you can always find some. Another barrel. Jam packed. Pickaxe broke. Great. Well, no backups on that one, and we gotta go home to probably grab some food. The danger is in the north with these big boys. Weapons to surpass Metal Gear. Did I get the metal detector yet? It hasn't been on sale in the store just yet.
Bum 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 bum. This reminds you a lot of Dungeon Keeper. This. Oh, we can cook two. Fr oh, actually, that's good. We can cook two fruits. When we get back, and that'll give us some energy for mining. Mark that as a diamond so I can find the house. Underneath underneath the mountain it'll sound like or it'll look like um Dungeon Keeper, really. What, what? Oh, I passed out. Well, now I'm going to die. Wait, what? Oh, wait. You actually pass out from swimming? Oh. Ah, eh, this cost a day. That's fine. Yeah, the game goes black and white when we have, like, low stamina. So, because that happened, we just go back home and sleep in the bed, which is totally cool. That's exactly where we're going, so it was a fast travel. Good. Okay, so now we can make some more food for our next goal. Means we need to go in here and grab some more food. Yeah, I was on the way back to cook food for one of our goals, so that worked out. Exactly what we wanted to happen. Good. It'll be a minute. I'm going to do a shameless plug for Discord a chance at free game keys. It says how I'm really enjoying this. Wow. Levi, thank you very much, dude. Giveaways in the Discord. Oh, it's different now. Alright, so now they want us to go... Harvest the figs, which is pretty easy. Uh, do a job for someone, which kind of rando, and craft three items. Okay. Let's see. Well, we have all this tin. We need another pickaxe. Oh, uh, no, we didn't die. We just passed out. Teleported back to the uh, base. Revive just means we uh, wake up at the bed. Okay, extra axe, extra pickaxe picked up. I'm going to have to start marking uh, mineral rich zones. Ugh. We should have another palm seed too, don't we? Yep. A couple more. do it here. Oh, 
Oh, I see you gotta do it one at a time. We go. Uh, where's our bug catcher? Oh, there. Okay. Well, right, let's put these pants away. Taking off my old pants. Now the only thing the game's missing, I think, is like a stacking system. An auto stack organizer thing. Okay, let's go find some rare earth minerals. Um, yeah, we'll go north. Oh, great, a crocodile. Oh, there's one. Anyway, there's also the figs quest. Let's do that instead. You'll find a desert area. Not too bad for those. Yeah, I didn't realize that swimming actually consumes stamina in this game. And that means that, yeah, there's a much better way to uh, get across that waters by having a verb come over. Now we need the fig specifically. It's got to be this color. No, I haven't tried uh, fishing yet, Chelsea. I think you have to fish with a big fish swimming around. I I've seen, like, fish pass by in the rivers. Maybe you have to throw your bait out there. I, I don't even know if you can bait a hook or if you just throw an empty line. What are these? They look like totems. Plus palm as well. Different style. Trying to get that. There it goes. Oh, termite nest. Ooh. Uh oh. Hungry like the wolf over here. Oh, they want us to gather 60 of those uh, figs from the... 
Hops of cacti? Okay. Oh, right, here we go. Cactus world. How do we mark this as, like, cactus world? Never come here again. Okay. I don't know if I've been grabbing them all. Uh oh, I hope so. Okay, we're only at 13. Let's at least get this quest done before the end of the day. I like the random daily quest too because it really, you know. If you're in the middle of a building project in your town and you're kind of getting bored of it and you just want some time off, it's a cool thing to do on the side. And when you're getting started, too, it's a lot of fun because then you can get some basic stuff unlocked, you know? How big is the game right now in terms of things to do and progression? Well, it looks like you can make a full town. You can explore the whole map. And there's like an underground uh, area, too, where we can go fight enemies, but we just haven't seen it yet. But so far, a good, good amount of things to do. And we're definitely going to be playing this one again, too. Um, we might be doing with... Maybe we'll start over with members. Oh. Hello. Oh, apples. Is that a tower over there? That's a radio tower, right? Oh yeah, we've seen those before. We need that to uh, let people know that they should totally come into our super awesome mega cool village. Crossing Valley. Well, remember, uh, Stardew and, um... Troy were taken from other games. And even, uh, that's not original. Wow, did... an emu? He didn't even see me. He didn't even care. That's good. Oh, good. The figs thing is done. Do a job for someone and craft three items. Easy. We'll just get some, uh, we'll make some pathway out of the stone. Can I please give you some advice? Uh oh. Are you baiting me? Are you going to ask a question? It might be a little awkward. Got to be something for later. I can't believe how far we get away from the base very quickly.
All right, back to base. Oh, wow. Nope. Oh, it's you. <laughs> You're not getting up here, pal. Wow, there's a lot of you, though. We're going to have to battle these guys. Violent over here. Um, let's see. This forest is lush and robust. The jungle. Oh god. It's a canyon. Safe now. Or now. And try to get a little bit more stone so we can make some more pathways. That'll make us profitable. Is it 60 or 6? It said... Oh, it was 6, but... The 60 for the um, points we get for doing it. But that cactus, that cactus fruit is really good. Lots of energy in that one. A bridge would be nice right here. Oh, there's a fish. Wait, let's try to do some fishing. I want to see how this works. Oh. We can grow the apple tree. Oh, we can make a torch with these trees? Okay. There we go. Taking a little damage because they're not cooked, but... We get back, we'll make a ton of these. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Now we gotta cook food. We're going to go straight east. going to try not to get distracted. I'm going to try, chat. Try not to get distracted. Try. Or die to death. Oh, boy. All right. Yeah, let's definitely cook up the uh, cactus figs because they give us energy. A lot of it. Good food. And we should probably make another smelter, but honestly, I don't think we need much more nails at the moment. Ooh, an achievement. Mm, 
barbecue, boys. Can't say no to BBQ. All right, speeding this up would require just a second campfire. Okay, we have eight stones. We need the gumwood stuff too. from a basic menu? No. Oh, it's here. Oh, cooked apples are good for health. Good. Oh, we gotta go in here. Ooh. Beer does four damage. Nice. Tin bar and gum wood plank. Oh, that's easy. Yeah, if we're going to buy the grill, we need 10k from the other guy. Okay. We'll make the other food here. There we go. Oh, we have 43 more of these things. We got we gathered a ton. Yeah, I could make my own crafting table. I guess I just didn't make one because at the time I was trying to save some, uh, materials and now our tent's a little small, so <laughs> I'm just trying to save space by walking over to the other building. But I can make one. This is very chill, I agree. Didn't Come was a game that a lot of people were playing uh, over the last couple of days, and I'm glad I played it first when it came out. I haven't had time to play since. Is, it, is this a good uh, BFGF game? Is this multiplayer? Uh, yes to both, I suppose, yeah. You definitely play this with your significant others or kids or you know adults playing together and stuff and working to build a, a village or a settlement. Kind of cool thing, too, would be maybe like somebody managing the farm while somebody else manages all the... Um, Someone goes and gathers all the materials needed while somebody else like, tends to farming. Alright, this will just be a minute. Do you know how large your Australian audience is? Oh, we can take a look.
What's up, Barry G? Chat, should we play this game again? Would you like to see me uh, do more Dinkum, perhaps with Bradford and Alex, maybe Pinto? The game you guys want to see more of? What do you think? Can we play more of this game? Let's cook the apples. Uh, it's nice, but the dungeon is too hard. Maybe you need help. Oh, really? Well, we'll see if we can get to the dungeon in, in the next few days or something like that. That'd be kind of cool. Tomorrow we won't have time to play this, but this game is so damn fun and super chill that uh, it just deserves my attention. Some games are so fun that... You know, they, they deserve the love. Well, let's see. Chat was curious about other Australians in the chat. So let's let's go uh, take a look real quick at analytics. I can, I think I can separate by country. Let's see. Hmm. Let's see. Geography, there we go. Let's see. Well, it's going to take a minute to load that. Wow, it's loading where everybody in the world lives. All right, well, top subscribers are United States, United Kingdom, Canada, Germany, and Australia in number five. Wow, not bad. So, yeah, top five are... Uh, United States, United Kingdom, Canada, Germany, and Australia. Which is interesting because there is an incredible amount of Dutch people who follow me. And the Dutch are in sixth place. So there are... Well, it doesn't tell me how many subscribers there are, but uh, about 7 million Australians... No, 10 million Australians have watched the videos. Um, they've watched for about 2 million hours which is 3% of all of the videos I've ever made. And they typically watch videos or live streams for about 11 minutes, which is pretty good. The Germans are a little less, but I assume that might be because of the language barrier. Where, uh, since it's not their native language, they might not watch as long before they perhaps go to look up somebody else who is uh, who speaks German. Maybe, maybe. How often do the nodes or oh do they respond? Oh, it could be daily. Actually, that that'd be a farming question, wouldn't it? Because like if you grow a bunch of cactuses out in front of your house, or let's say you're growing an apple tree, good question. I'm cooking all my food tonight. That way we don't have to. We don't have to cook for a while. Also, a new thing to claim. I love how you get, like, points for everything in this game, like a, an achievement. Like, we passed out from... Basically, like, swimming across the lake because we were out of energy. We got an achievement for being, like, super tired. Which actually benefits us because we needed those points. So the fact that we, uh... The fact that we just did that. There you go. A dinkum flicker. Hmm. Strange. How curious. Craft three items. Um... Well, I guess I could craft an another box. Oh, yeah. Palm wood for sure. We're going to make another box, and I've got nails, too. Yeah, we're going to need another box. Uh, let's do this. Wait, what's going to happen? 
Oh, it goes just right there. Lols, I'm dying. Who saws in their tent? If you snore. Yeah, if you snore, it's it's like you're you're sawing. You know what I mean? And of course, another achievement. It's all good. You're watching from uh, Nicaragua. Thank you very much for tuning in. Ah, nice to have everybody all over the world watching. It is cool when someone's like, "Hey, bro, big big fan from Sri Lanka or something," and it's like, "Wow, cool." Uh, convince John to stay. Place the required items in the construction box. Yep. All right. Let's. Uh, speaking of boxes, let's make a new box for storage. I'm going to need to... I think the only way I'm going to get this inventory organized is by literally... Um, making enough boxes to actually sh uh, shuffle things around. Yeah. Yeah. I'm from Sri Lanka. See? Right there. Boom. Told you. Told you. Anybody from Kuala Lumpur? Well, actually, why don't why, chat? Why don't you give a shout out to uh, the people in your country that might be watching where you're from? Maybe there's a fellow Canadian watching. Maybe there's somebody from uh, New Zealand hanging out. Maybe there's somebody from Boston or Yinzer watching. Maybe there's uh, somebody from Mexico, Panama. Maybe there's somebody from uh, Mongolia. Uh, let's see. Wow, another box. Okay, this is cool. So I'm going to have to figure out like how I want to organize these. I guess, okay, we'll put building materials here. Oh, we should make another, make a crafting bench. I wish I could just rip the one out of the uh, tent here. Kind of annoying that the... Crafting table is here, and I can't move it. Simple animal trap. Tin, sticks, and old springs. Oh, it's windmill compatible. Ooh. Yeah, there's our cooking table. Oh, it's just a tin bar and tin sheet. We found that. Be able to do some cooking inside, although our house is very small. And just a tin bar for that, too. Okay, so that's easy. Is sleeping the only way to save? Uh, well, I guess you could quit to main menu. Maybe it'll save where you are. I don't know if it actually kicks you back to your previous day's progress. Good question. Chat, do you know? Is sleeping the only way to save? Can you use the fl can you use flowers to create dyes and color the boxes? Ooh, good question. Don't know. Would be nice to be able to label them somehow, especially if you get complicated. I did it again. There we go. Oh, if you quit to the main menu or desktop, you'll lose your progress? Okay. So, so make sure you go to bed. You'll lose out on the day, but there you go. Uh, Puerto Rico Heritage in the chat. Nice. Awesome. Southern California in the chat. All right. Yeah, give yourselves a shout out. 
right, this is probably going to be ready any minute. Oh, yep. Oh, interesting. When it hits midnight, that's interesting. Up, upper left corner, once it hits midnight, you get like a limited timer. It becomes late, and then anything you do probably costs an incredible amount of stamina. So, smart idea to return to your base at midnight. To, okay, that's cool. That's kind of a good way to do all your end game or end day work. You can stay out for a full day. Once it hits midnight, be home by midnight, and then do minimal labor stuff. Like maybe put stuff in storage and whatnot. In this case, we're going over to uh, make a crafting bench. Yeah, the Australians are coming out of the woodwork tonight. Cool. Australia is definitely, definitely on my list of uh, places to go. I don't have as many friends that I'm in contact with there that uh, as I used to have because they're all, uh, you know, they're they're all growing up, becoming big boys. So they're focused on buying houses and starting families. You know, that's good though. I mean, it's sad that they betrayed gaming, but uh, you know, fine. All right, well, now we have a crafting table here. That's cool. So, good idea to, I guess, just keep all of our storage here. Alright, cool. Oh, you'll buy me a beer? Oh, that's nice of you. I certainly like that. Alright. Now, final attempt to get organized. And I don't even know where to start. Um, this game needs a uh, auto-organize button. Put likewise materials together. there anything here? Alright, you know what? I'm just going to put all my tools in here just to clear my inventory. We'll put like tool, food and tools in here, like usable things that we probably always want with us. And then if we make more, we can store them in here as backup. All right, random crap in this box that I don't know what to do with just yet. So definitely the uh, rings. Yeah, I don't know what, what these things do yet, so I'm going to throw them in there. Beat. Can I, can I hang this little kangaroo sign up? Oh, I can't, like, decorate with it? Oh. Okay, food back here. And it feels good to actually get organized. Oftentimes in games, I don't want to do this because it's so tedious, and I usually usually end up getting a bunch of new stuff anyway. So you know, you take all the time to get organized, and then it's messy again. But I guess that's kind of the fun. My favorite thing is like when you got a messy inventory, and then you go to craft a few things, and it cleans up your inventory for you. This will help you, help us to tally up what we got. And so much food. Food and plants here. Three tires. I wonder if we get more, uh, if we can make a car.
And then we'll just put building materials here. Things that we can build or craft with. Or that I suspect that that's what I can do with it eventually. anything with that butterfly. I don't know why. But we'll figure that out. Okay. Oh, now I can do something with it. Oh, he flew away. <laughs> Bye, pal. It wouldn't let me, like, store him or do anything with him. I guess because he's a living creature. At least he's out of the inventory now. Out of my hair. Not my problem anymore. He's flown the coop. That's fine. We can get a million more. Alright, let's do... Yeah, we'll do a bunch of these. That's food. And we'll save a few things for later. Very nice. Alright, so that's a really good tactic. Is just wait until midnight. Then it becomes late. And then you just go home. And, uh... Like, basically manage your inventories and craft items and stuff. That's pretty damn cool. Alright, time for bed. There we go. All it a day. Level 8 mining, or foraging. Level 6 mining and no money earned. No money down. Order now. Oh, passing out will do damage to your tools, the game said. Interesting. Very nice. Very nice indeed. All right, you know what else would be nice, Chad? Is us to find somebody else who's playing Dinkum and go say hello. This game is too phenomenally amazing and too many people are playing it not for me to come back for more. So in the future, we'll play more of our single player game and maybe perhaps some multiplayer games with the boys and find out, um, you know, what it's like to build a community together within that game. So we'll see how it goes. Anyway, you guys have been amazing. Thank you very much for jumping in very late stream tonight because of, you know, me being out and some maintenance on my internet. Should be back tomorrow for a full um, day of live streams and whatnot. So it should be lots of fun. Lots of new games tomorrow, including Stray, a game about being a cat, and also, um, Hell Let Loose is getting an update. I don't see anybody else playing Dinkum. I don't see anybody else that I know live streaming. Oh, man. What if we just go to YouTube Live? We gotta go raid somebody. We gotta go say hi to somebody and, and have a good, good time with them. What else is similar to Dinkum? We could do... Hmm. Nobody else is live with Dinkum. Can I just search gaming live in general? YouTube is such a horrible place to navigate. I don't even know how to, like, search for gaming anymore. There we go. Gaming. Oh, and then I can't filter any further. Just randomly select stuff. Okay. Hmm. Can you sleep your... Can you bring your sleeping bag with you to rescue if you're far from home? Yeah, I guess you could. That's a good... That's a good tactic. I suppose. Let's see. We gotta find somebody. What else is similar to Dinkum? Let's go with Stardew Valley. That's too popular for somebody not to be live with it. Then you guys should tell them to check out Dinkum too and be like, hey, would you like Dinkum? Would you want to check out Dinkum? You know? Don't be like pushy about it, but just ask them if they've heard of it and if they'd be interested. Here we go. Let's try this. Starting my first farm in Stardew Valley. Here we go. Alright guys, we're gonna go say hello to Return of the Snack. Now that's a damn good name. <laughs> oh, wrong screen. Here we go. Return of the Snack here is playing a uh, little Stardew. Ask them if they've heard of Dinkum about, uh, you know, the Australian 
open world survival simulator. So damn good music, damn good game, and a damn fine day for me. So I'll see you all tomorrow. Thank you very much, everybody, for supporting and whatnot. Raptor, there's a quick move for the items. Yes, hold shift. That's how to do it. But I was being real picky about my organization. All right, uh, there's the URL to their channel that they're streaming on right now. And I'm going to also see if I can do the actual raid. It hasn't been working for a while. I suspect it'll be the same thing tonight where I try to raid other channels and YouTube's like, no. So. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did it accept it? <gasps> Wait. No way. Is it actually fixed after 12 days? Holy crap it is. Nope. YouTube could not save your changes, of course. I would not expect for it to actually do what it's supposed to. All right, anyway, go say hi to that channel. Get out of here, folks. Tell them I say hi, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Good night, everybody. See you. Take care. Good night. Bye, everyone.